Hi everyone, my name is Jun Zhao. I'm a painter, a printmaker, and a paper maker. Today I'm going to show you how to paint in four seasons with the simple painting techniques. I hope you will find them useful. Okay, let's get started. For material and tools, you need some cards. Watercolors, water, pencil and brushes for your design and uh, painting. Using brush to draw, so start from the top, goes down, goes up, goes down, goes up, goes up, goes up. Create different shape of trees and another one. Mm -hmm. A new one in the front. Using light green dot around the branch. Feeling like a springtime now, isn't it? The front one adds a bit more on tiny stage. Add a little bit darker one, dark green, so give it a bit more detail to the back. I will add a bit more light green so that shows you more depth painting a little bit suggestions there's some life there using red dots randomly somewhere on the card maybe higher a little bit more further up mix blue and for the sky brush over mix light blue with green that's the feel on the back mix green then you feeding in the gap you don't have to feeding in all the lead area some of them overlap, some of them leave it and lay the brush brush over the surface. Some are maybe a bit more dark. Just using the tip of the brush and press it and that shows you the trees in the distance. You can do more is apply a tiny dot. I like a play dot. Using brush to play dot. And then touch it and bring the color into the foreground. What's next is using really heavy 
right and just go a little bit over on top now give you more depth and create a more interesting landscape very simple using strong green just tiny bit touch the foreground give it a bit suggestion that's thin or plants and to the back changing the position of a brush and just using the tip Here's a tiny brush and painting a bird that creates a sky. Maybe five. Thinking about autumn color, it nicely brown. Changing brush, the paint brush, and the apply yellow just randomly go over. No matter if the branch isn't dry yet, still very nicely, and you can see the color changed. In order to make a color change, mix the yellow first, and then dab a little bit orange, and then you paint it. Apply a tiny bit red and just run they go around the tree and see the red simply touch it and that changing the feeling of the tree. Now we have an autumn season. What we do to make it a bit nicer is mix a little bit green and touch somewhere. Again, I like to play with dots and that shows you some life. Add a bit more dark color, give you a space, a shadow, create a trunk and maybe create another one. And this time, just tiny, same, we apply a little bit color onto the branch. See? Autumn's here. Again, painting a bird. Now for the winter, need to paint in the sky first, to the background. Slightly dark color. And that's beautiful sky. I will mix a little light gray and go over brush the space. Once the background dry, in the trees down. This time start from the top goes down onwards like a brush and maybe have another one. Mix nice green just do it on top and the edge there on top on the edge same as here go around and here add a bit more the edge tie yes oh, so we have a pine tree if I 
point in the brush. Touch. Knock, knock, knock on top. So that, the dark background helps. The white shows out. And you can put more on top. Now, the paint is covered. Now the pie tree is covered, you can have a nice Christmas card. Add a bit more white for the snow. And to the back, put the dots. Again, that gives you suggestions of life. There's a bit on here as well. My tree almost gone, so I will add it a bit darker green. Stronger green that shows you something. Yeah, here you go. Hmm. Maybe I'll. Thank you for watching. I hope you enjoyed it. Bye!